sorry. I'm uh, for myself again. I'm doing water pollution, and I made a discount on Tuesday the 12th. So if you bring your reusable cup on that day, we would the Global Cafe would have given you a discount. Why? Why only one day? Uh, because today, uh, Mr. John said that they can't do it like this year, but next year they can. They will do it. So I said, well, I need it done by next week, which was last week. Yeah. So they said, okay, we can do it on Monday and Tuesday. So that's what happened. What's the reason for not being able to do it all the time? I'm not very sure. You're going to ask Mr. John. Why do I have to? I can ask it for you. I think you probably should, because okay. this is a bit of a barrier for your action, isn't okay. it? Yeah. So that, I mean, what's so complicated? Why is it so complicated? Not very sure. A lot of yeah. business yeah. Yeah. That's true. That's true. Okay, so you've done this with the cups. What else are you working on at the moment? What, what do you mean? For your exhibition. Oh, after this, I might... Uh, I'm going to talk to Mr. Frank about how I'm going to... We're going to get a GoPro and put it under the water at Riverside and see what we can find under there. Okay. Yep. And what are you hoping to find? I'm hoping not to find any plastic. Okay. So you're, you're really focusing on products that end up in the water yeah, rather than chemical people... pollution? No, I'm, I'm, I, I just got, I'm about to test for nitrates and stuff from a lot of the like, fertilizers and so on. So I, I'm doing chemicals too, but what you can see is what people, uh, yeah. I, I want people to know what it gets thrown in because no one knows and ha no one can see the heavy metals inside there, right. the chemicals in there, and so on. Right, okay, so this is the visible stuff, yeah? Yeah. Okay. So how many people have done the, the cut thing? Well, yesterday seven people, and today there's over seven of last time, so times two, seven. Okay, but those numbers are still pretty bad, right? Yes. Yeah. So how do you how do you make your campaign more persuasive? We, we need like time. And we need people to have time to get more awareness about what's happening around them. Then they'll start noticing what happened today. Okay, and how do you make that awareness hurry up a bit? By putting, uh, by my map, by telling it verbally and by putting around posters in. Okay, and you have done a poster. Why do you think this poster wasn't particularly effective? Because it's small and it has a few things that went wrong. Okay, so it's got mistakes on it? Yeah. Yeah. And it doesn't work. Like, if you didn't make that poster and you walked past it, would you stop and look at it? Well... No. 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 I just saw it. Why, why wouldn't you stop and look at that, Mr. Watts? There's nothing that, there's nothing that catches your eye. So there's nothing to draw you in and there's too many words. Because it, yeah, because it would mean I'd have to stand and read it. And uh, often people don't have time to stand and read it, so you need to be like, grab you, look at it, get the message, walk on. Yeah. Perfect. Now, here's, your problem is that they've only agreed to do this today. Yeah. And so, yesterday. And yesterday. So you're, you're going to have to go back to Mr. John, who's right over there, and say, look, I haven't had much success. Can we extend this? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah? yeah? And use your negotiation skills. <laughs> yeah. There you've got them, so just use them. Persuade them. This is why no, they no, can persuade, do it. Exactly. Persuade the argument. He's got an Achilles heel. He really is very pro the school, very pro the environment, and very pro healthy, healthy food. So if you go from that point of view and stress those words, but really nice to him, without the skill of a, a negotiator, you could put him right. Yeah. Okay, so your priorities today? One, talk to Mr. Watts, uh, Mr. Mr. Frank, 
and then I will talk to Letizia about how we're going to design our exhibition wall and also see and talk to Mr. John what days we can also do this before next week. Okay, and which one do you think you should do first? I would like to do uh, Thursday and Wednesday or maybe the entire week. Okay. All right, and which conversation? You've got three conversations you've got to have this afternoon. Mr. John, Letizia, Mr. Frank. Which one do you think you should have first? Letizia, because it will be the shortest, then uh, Mr. John, then Mr. Frank. Okay, all right. Thank you. Did you manage to talk to Mr. John? Yes, we can do it the entire week. Perfect. That's a real result. Yep. Yeah. Now just improve your advertising. Yeah. All right, well done. See ya. See ya.